Strictly Come Dancing 2023 star Adam Thomas has opened up on his health struggles after string of meds failed to get his arthritis under control. Strictly Come Dancing's Adam Thomas courageously battled through last year's series of the BBC show for an impressive seven weeks, despite his arthritis causing him agonizing pain. However, in a fresh update on his arthritis journey, the actor revealed that the numerous medications and painkillers he's been prescribed by doctors have failed to stabilize the condition. Putting on a brave face by smiling broadly into the camera with wife Caroline, the Waterloo Road star told fans he has today tried steroid injections. He added that the next step will be to experiment with a disease-modifying drug, which hell be on for the rest of my life or until I go into remission. The 35-year-old captioned his latest Instagram post. Little update on my arthritis journey so far. So been in and out of hospital for a while now. Tried all sorts of medications and painkillers. But nothing's really working. So time to try something new. Today I had steroid injections, which really helped ease the pain and inflammation last time so hopefully it will do the same until my prescription arrives for the new medication. He added, I will be trying a disease-modifying drug which I will then take, if it works, for the rest of my life or until I go into remission. It's been a long and hard battle and as of yet nothing has worked, but I'm hopeful. Adam continued that the year had spent battling his arthritis had been the toughest of his life so far. I'm a firm believer of everything happening for a reason, but I don't really have the answer to why I have the condition just yet, he mused. He then concluded his heartfelt caption by telling his one million followers, if I'm being completely honest, I'm suffering, I don't think I want to suffer in silence no more x. Rheumatoid arthritis is an autoimmune condition where the immune system attacks the joints and causes uncomfortable and sometimes debilitating pain. Although there is no cure, symptoms can be kept under control and sufferers may go into remission for long periods, only facing flare-ups at certain times. According to the NHS website, it typically affects more women than men, and can also be more likely to occur if a sufferer has a family history of the condition, or smokes.